Wait, hello! Bully is here, welcome back to more Let's Play Warsaw. I need to pick up my controller, rather than mouse and keyboard. So last time we were introduced to the Great Dragon, and we were forced to have allies that we really didn't need. But we won, and now the dragon is retreating into the darkness! The wounded dragon ran into the Valley of Alinst. Garrett and his army followed after it for one more fatal attack. Win condition is defeating the dragon, and we lose upon the death of Garrett. This is a cool mission. This is the first mission I've really felt confident about doing without any um, large number of soldiers. So, I'll show you what I mean by that. First of all, make sure that we have everyone but Lance, because Lance is a experienced hog and we don't need him. We have Sabra for our dragon knightery. Alright, let's go ahead and end that. So, um, for our army, we are going to take four guardsmen. Four guardsmen. And we're going to take... We're going to take a bunch of uh, horsemen for Kalei. Uh, mostly as insurance, more than anything else. But other than that, I have everyone that I want. Oh yeah, uh, before I forget, items. Okay, Evil Axe for Kalei, because we want her to kill things and level up and become awesome. Um... Who should get Warsong? Uh, stuff I should have planned out ahead of time, perhaps. Um, go ahead and give Warsong... Oh, no. Give Warsong to Tiburon. He's already got a high attack. I mean, uh, I could give it to Sabra as well. Let's go to Tiburon, though. Uh, the shield to Garrett. The great sword to... Um, I'm actually going to say Tamina. Just, oh no, she's going to have, for what she's going to do, she's going to have an easy, easy time. Wand. Cross. And Amulet. Uh, I mean, she's the only one really with soldiers. Alright. That should be good. What? No, I said end. Oh, start. There we go. So, let's place units. The important thing is to have Mina up here, and we'll have her supported with, uh, uh with Tiburon. We'll give her, um, Thorn just in case. Uh, Sabra. I actually want you right here. Kalei, forward line. Garrett, uh, behind Sabra, and the rest of you guys just, I mean, your cavalry, you'll get there, you'll get where you need to be. See, so the important part here is, look at them slimes, the guardsmen shall rise again. It escaped, it ran through there. This is a really weird valley. Maybe headed for its lair, hurry before it gets away. Um, by valley, you mean probably actually a cave system? Maybe? Sort of? So the dragon is here. It has its own Styrocosars uh, now. Uh, we've got Gorgosars here with carrion crawlers. We have uh, ants and ant queens. And we have our favorite blobs! I'm so happy to see them. Also, we have a body here and a treasure chest. Well, we'll have to get Sabra over there eventually and see what that's all about. But to start... Uh, there's a... I mean, the best choke point's kind of, like, right here, but... You know, we're not in a huge position to really take advantage of it. What I think I'm gonna do... Is I'm going to move Sabra here for now. Uh, this is impassable terrain. We're going to be using her to absorb uh, firepower from the the Gorgasars. T 
to make that happen, though... Oh, yeah, uh, turn your command to manual. These guys are going to... Uh, I'm not exactly sure how I want to do this. I mean, I kind of want to just post right here. At the very least, move these guys up. Run, Garrett! I am only having moderate w uh, desires that you were a great knight, but... You know, the story must be upheld. Garrett must be a king. Um, and honestly, king has served us pretty well with... with his uh, combat bonuses. Um, let's move Mina here. And... We'll put the guardsmen in a little formation here. Oh, uh, I think I screwed that up. A little bit. I think it'll be fine. They're slimes. These are guardsmen. Um, again, this is... I mean, this is kind of really the best choke point, but I want to force them to attack Calais. We have Calais move here. Hmm. Oh, here we go. That's perfect. Um, we'll just move the rest of her knights into a general zone of being nearby. And that'll let me move Tiburon down. Yeah. So this this controls the area perfectly. Uh, Calais is going to get attacked. It'll have to do. But these ants are, are basically going to be cannon fodder. End phase. Alright, let's watch the slimes move. I'm not, per again, like this part over here, this is just going to be cathartic. Uh, as we watch a whole bunch of peasants with uh, torches wreak havoc upon the, the forces of monstrosity. Though, so, it's, it's interesting how slimes and blobs tend to be... Oh, I love watching... Ah, oh, it's just a lightning tornado! It's interesting how slimes and blobs tend to be such a common enemy in fantasy games like this. I wonder if it's because they're they're so easy to animate. Uh, it, whereas, like in D and D, you have what you you've got the uh, the oozes like the ochre jelly or whatever. They uh, they don't tend to be as common. I, I see them maybe like once every 10, 15 sessions I play. Uh, it was actually a surprise in the most recent game I played where they ha we happened to fight one. It's like we never see these things. It's just something to talk about, something to think about as we watch these guardsmen just destroy the slimes. Alright, and the ant is moving south. Uh, I wasn't actually sure if it was going to move north or south or not. Uh, you know, it's kind of equidistant depending on how it how it's positioned knights oh oh you're attacking interesting go ahead try it again i dare you i think Kalei is going to be in a good position to level up this mission maybe even twice ooh yeah but if she gets hit she she really takes a beating and now that she's missed a few she's going to get hurt. But that's fine. What I can do is I can position, I can use another knight while uh, Kalei heals. Um, the knights are very powerful against these ants. Um, and it's, it's satisfying to watch how much damage they can do. But unfortunately they tend to do enough damage that they're, they will get wiped out. Uh, as a result of killing all the enemies that they're facing. So. Oh. 
The worms are going for the treasure. But as I was saying, I think it's it's something to be concerned about. That said, they are all clustered right there. Literally all of them just right there. I should have moved my knights into a better position. Because we could do some work. All right, uh, Sabra, you can get into position as well, speaking of. Uh, 16 MP. It's thunder, though. Yeah, that literally hits all of them. No, shoot. Counter charge. Oh, that wrecked him. That just wrecked them. Yeah, I mean, the, it tends to be a one for one trade. But I think this will be a reasonable offing to, to do. We'll swing down from here. Yeah, one to one, one mostly, but the knights often can get the upper hand. I really do like the knights in this game, or the horsemen, but not quite knights. Oh, but I'm not going to get to... Oh. Hmm. Oh, well. I think it'll be worth it to... Well, shoot. Let's do this. Let's actually clear the field a bit. These guys are all going to have to recover. Yeah. This will go well. I'll have to retreat the knights. Maybe even heal Kalei. But I only need one burst of magic to really bring the dragon down, I think. Oh, I planned that badly. I might lose a knight. Hmm. They only he only has lightning. But he has healing. Magic. Healing. Can you reach? No, you can't. So we're going to go ahead and move Garrett right here. We're going to move the rest of Kalei's knights, because... I mean, this choke point did work against me here. But... I think it'll be fine. Let's move the rest of our magic knights down. I could spend a uh, thunder. And... But that might kill. Uh, it might kill him. I don't want to risk it. Yeah, let's not risk it. Um, I do want Kalei to get the majority of that experience. All right, uh, guardsmen. Time to shine. And I do mean shine those torches upon the faces of those slimes. Alright, you move here. And, yeah. This is going to go really well. Mina, she probably won't get two levels, but she'll definitely be level two by the end of this. And I don't have to worry about uh, positioning at all because of the amulet. Doubling her command range. All right, I'll have Mina attack this thing first. Because she has Cuckoo Defense, and that slime does not do very much damage to her. So a trade of three to one is pretty good. These guys are just gonna finish it off. Yeah, look at that, level two Mina. All right, 
Um, gonna have to wait for that slime for a while, but that'll give me time to heal up. All right, end phase. Let's see if we lose any knights. Um, so I could fast forward through some of this with the uh, the emulator, but my only issue with that is it tends to make it a hard to follow, b the sound gets squeaky and painful to listen to, and c it's just nauseating. It moves so quickly. He's gonna treat. They're gonna recover. Literally, oh, so this guy's gonna attack. So I might lose these knights. Yeah, I'm gonna lose them because, if only because uh, that. No, because the, all the rest of them are too injured to really attack. Oh, oh, just barely missed. Okay, good. Uh, I was actually worried about the explosion radius there. But we're good, we're good. So I'm gonna retreat some of the knights out and move other ones into position. Let's make that happen. First of all, treat yourself. Uh, you move back. Uh, you, I want... I really do want him, that, that one gone. Yeah. I, I want those worms gone. Or those ants. That does mean that the other, the, the big ant's gonna attack. But it doesn't have a huge defense, and the horsemen will probably do some serious work on it. So we're gonna move right here. And we are going to have a fresh unit of you know what let's go ahead and attack this oh. that was a poor choice that was a poor choice that I made magic healing Uh, we're gonna hit here, bring the knights back up, and, oh, uh, where's the Tiburon? He's got 8 MP, and I could, could assault them. I think the better choice would be just to move one knight here and not attack. As for Mina, go ahead and treat. Just, yeah, that's a good defensive position. Oh, uh, Sabra needs to treat. And... Yeah. I think this is good. End of phase. And the guardsmen will move as they will. That doesn't bug me. I just don't want that lead boss slime to do the uh, the thing that the uh, Gorgasar did last game. It's baffling and really frustrating to see happen. But right now we're in a really good position vis-a-vis... Uh, -vis, um, who is it? Uh, Sabra's... Uh, Yep, I saw that coming. Uh, gonna have to weaken that. Magic arrow shot should do just fine. But yeah, the, the explosion isn't gonna hit any of my knights, and it's not gonna do very much damage to Sabra. So, I'll just suck up all of their MP and stall them and just choke point that whole area. It's basically exactly what I wanted. Alright, um, I 
You know what? Magic. Let's do it. Yeah, that was perfect. Uh, go ahead and... Go ahead and magic another healing. Uh, right here. This guy doesn't have anything else, right? Oh yeah, he does. Shoot. Hit that guy. Go ahead and do an all-out offensive. Uh, we've got some more knights. We have reserves. Um, let's just charge these guys in. If I get Kalei to level 10, or, you know, the next level, it will be enough. Even if I lose, even if I don't get maximum experience from that. The, the real problem is just getting her to the, the final class is just such a pain. She is taking a lot of damage. Hmm. Okay. That was unfortunate. Uh, treat. And let's move a knight to cover her position. And also one right here so that less of uh, these creepy crawlies are healing and then we'll move these guys here a to cover and b for her to get uh to heal them as for this let's move hmm let's move here and give them plenty of targets to attack Plenty of angles. All right, end phase. We'll see how well my strategy works. Okay, good. So why are they so strung out like that? Some of the automatic movement, the pathfinding here, is very awkward. Oh, why are you? And why are you attacking? Oh, you have. Very little in the way of health now, sir. It was perhaps a poor choice that you have made. Oh, and the ants won that. Surprising, given the, the the numbers that the knights have actually pulled out. Like, the knights should win this one, or the horsemen. Yeah, barely, but they did. Uh, he was going to die anyway if he didn't. Oh no, fireballs! Oh no! Alright, well... You know what, let's treat that. Okay. As for plan of attack... Let's do this. Um, and we're going to attack. We're going to at least get to level 9. Uh, yeah. Level 9. What is her range? Oh, it's not enough. Um, hmm. I could just really run the risk. 
I think that would be a terrible choice to make. I think instead we're gonna treat. It means losing night means losing a night. Um, yeah. At, at, at most, it's gonna be the carrion crawler here is going to uh, recover a bit, or the ant queen, I mean. But we should be fine. All right, and you set to manual, and that's gonna be good. And let's watch some slimes die. <laughs> it's not even it's not even a question. These slimes will die. They their fate has been sealed. They are in the book of the dead already. An ode to the slain monster. All right, yeah, you're treating. You're gonna attack the horseman and get generally wrecked. Get wrecked, man. All right. Oh, are they out of mana now? Looks like. Yep. Let's see how well the horsemen deal with the uh, carrying crawlers. Oh, they are destroying them. I'm gonna lose some more horsemen then. We'll have Sabra help out in a moment. Um, I might even just pull back. So let's see. And the carrying crawler, the the ants have twenty one defense. The carrying crawlers have twenty four. So. So let's see. I'm okay with losing some losing the rest of my horsemen actually. Um, oh, he still has 4 MP, so he's going to hit, and it's going to be this line right here. Um, frankly, I want to take the ants out. That is important to me. Um, yeah, let's do it. Come on, guys. One more. Thank you. Um, treat. Treat. is going to treat next turn. Alright, fine. Oh, come on! It did not have... Sometimes I forget... Sometimes they all, I, I, I associate those as archers and I, make, I have them attack in the, in the wrong pattern. It, it really is kind of a dumb habit of mine. I'm going to lose stuff now. Because I was uh, a fool. But I think. I think I have a plan. First of all, I'll leave those guys there. Um, I'm actually going to move. Mina is officially fine. We're going to go ahead and move to, uh, Thorn over here to the rest of the group. Last healing that I'm going to do. End of phase. I could attack that ant. I really should, probably. But I think so long as Kalei gets the killing blow on some of the boss monsters. And the important ones for her to fight would be the uh, Gorgasars. And she's going to get a you know, a fair chunk of experience from that. 
it, I haven't looked it up, but I do believe that knights have some advantage against carrying crawlers, because they seem to do better against them than they do against the ants. Um, other thing I'm going to do is I'm definitely going to spam a bunch of spells against the, the dragon's uh, minions, the, the Sterekasars. Because that way I can just plow through them and then while the dragon's treating, just hit it with more spells. Oh uh, yeah. I think it's going to behoove me to have my, my people defend Kalei. She got a she got a, a bunch of experience off of all that though. I, again, I don't feel bad about it. Hit your own dude. Nope. Still, um, Sabra has fulfilled her purpose. She has tanked out. Does the dragon have magic? It does. All right, that's not a problem. Um, well, let's bring Thorn, Mr. Thorn, down. And how to optimally do this? You know what? We'll do it next time, because I just realized what time it is. I will see you all then. Thanks so much for watching.